what is he doing over there? <laughs> <laughs> oh, for God's sake. Oh, yeah, we know. <laughs> yeah, we see you, buddy. Yeah. We got you. Question is, what are you doing? Hi. Well, it looks like he messed up. There's a lot of rats in this yard. He really did he, he really did something. What are you doing? Look sideways? Or pulling him out? I don't oh, know. I don't know. I need to go look. Okay. Hey man. Uh pile of mud. That's all it is. You missed. Yeah. Well no, actually I was turning around. What happened was I went off right here, right? You see, actually, uh, you see, see a scrape, yep. Tried to wiggle around. And then I tried to get it back up there. It just kept I, getting it worse. Just kept, <laughs> it, got, it, it got stuck right there, you can see it. Yeah. So I tried to back up right here and then it just sent me all the way over here. And I didn't uh, want to hit that tree or that tree, so I was like, nope, I'm calling somebody. Yeah. Well, I tried to push out first and then that didn't happen either. So, uh, I was gonna say you could. I mean, I didn't know if you had a winch on the front. I could you could go that way real fast, um, or just try to go. Up yeah, here, I'll, I'll probably just try to come back forward to the road that way because people come flying around these corners right here. I don't, I don't want them to get us. Ooh, maybe I'll turn around.
Okay, we're at most of the way. This truck is gonna have to. You're good. You're good. It's good. It's gonna be close, but you're good. You're good. Yep. Yeah, he just tried to turn around and got got off, and it's easy to do. And this ledge here. No. That's about a six inch ledge here on the edge of this road, so. And then with all the rain that we've had, this makes it kind of slick. Yeah, you'll probably have to hit up a car wash. There's one down here on 321. Yeah, no problem. Thank you guys so much. You're welcome. Okay, guys, welcome back to the channel. We are winding our afternoon through Sky Harbor. This is uh, a well-known place to get hung up. So just make like a U right here. On the left? Right. right. Follow oh, pizza. Yeah. Pizza guy knows where he's going. Turn yeah, right coming up this way, guys. Rose Pass and we'll Schoolhouse Gap. Schoolhouse Gap. Those are all crazy, crazy roads. Um, okay, so I think this is your road right here. Yes. Parkway View Court is where we're going to the right. <laughs> Sorry. This is your road, right? <laughs> we uh, we got called for a uh, a little car that's down in a driveway and cannot make it back up to the main road, so he can continue his afternoon uh, I think it's evening I think it's night now plans is evening plans your destination is on the left should be right here on the left yes right there is that it yep so yes it's snowing yes it's 32 degrees out yes it's gonna start getting slick is he just in the driveway is there a problem I, I will. I'm not sure entirely he said his car just didn't have enough oomph, his words, to back up out of the driveway. Surely not. It doesn't, it doesn't look like it needs anything. That's the address he gave us. I don't want to turn around, I guess. Alright. Oh, okay. Well, it makes more sense from this direction, I guess. No, not really. Yeah, it looks like he's right up against the porch. And it looks like maybe he might have gone the front wheels over the edge. Wrong though. Huh? What's going on? I mean. I guess I don't. I think it's just off camber, and I think he maybe is nervous because it keeps going forward. Huh. I feel like that's the situation. I could be wrong. We might not even be in the right spot. I don't think we're even in the right spot. I mean, if that's it, then. Because it looks like I could just back it up. Why would I not just back it up? Is it rear wheel drive? It's an explorer, it should be, right? It's 
see the front wheel or all wheel? I don't know. I don't well, I don't know. Maybe they made these in rear wheel. I'm not sure. I'm not sure anybody's gonna come to the door to let you know. It is a that's rear wheel, I think. Yeah, rear wheel drive. You know, they made them just rear wheel drive. Thought they were front wheel or all wheel. Anyway, doesn't look that bad. But I guess maybe it's peeling out and it needs a little help. Sure, if these things were like a mess of them were all wheel drive or front wheel drive, but you got you got the worst of the situation, didn't you? Maybe <laughs> over that way. you this way? Yeah. Yeah, you're not you're not down there in the trees yet, so <laughs> Um, if the, yeah, if the keys are in, if you just want to start it up and put it into neutral, she should be able to help hey, you. Why don't, why don't you get in it, Jeff? Keys it on backwards. Jeff, will you get in it, please? He's still got plenty of room. Oh yeah, he's got it. Awesome. Good deal. Good deal. You're very welcome. You're very welcome. <laughs> you did good. You did good. That was an easy pull. Okay guys, welcome back to the channel. We are on Ski Mountain tonight. It's um, about 30 minutes before the midnight hour, 28 degrees, and just when I thought I was done with uh, snow recoveries, I guess we're gonna, we're gonna throw out one more here. We're headed up Zermatt. Turn left onto Zermatt Drive. Is this the one that has the upper and the lower? Seems that way. And you always go the wrong way. Always. Car took off out of the driveway. In a quarter mile, your destination will be on the right. Down over the edge. In the snow. At night.
Your destination is on the right. Why does this driveway seem somewhat familiar? Hmm, there's the car. Oh, I see it. Is this where we got the uh, the Subaru? No, I think this is where we got the. Uh... Damn, we've been here a bunch. He's way down there. Yes, he is. Yeah, this is the Subaru, isn't it? Yeah, this is the Subaru. Because I remember those power lines being super low. Concerning. Remember, there's not much room over here on this side. I went all the way up and went from up there, didn't I? Um, the second time you did. So we were here a second time, you remember? During the day. There's not much room over here. And you slid down, remember? Calling the snow, and it's like kept on going that way. Yeah. So, yeah. Huh. Uh, wow. Yeah, I'm gonna come. Hopefully, yeah, I can get it out. Believe it or not, this is the third time we've been to this driveway. Oh, that well, same spot. This is great. <laughs> <laughs> I just hope we can get it in the snow. Would y'all believe it? Uh, I had just got this car today. You just got it today? No way! Yeah. It, did the airbags go off? No. Okay. It, was, just, it just slid down. It didn't turn over or anything like that. Okay. Yeah, I was just looking at it funny from here. It looked like airbags hanging in the window down there. Nah, that's just, <laughs> just the roof. It's, it's, <laughs> it's that steep of an angle. Yeah. Yeah, because uh, this, this is my first time coming up here and uh, I was like, Where's the cabinet? I, I, I looked up this hill and I was like, yeah, I probably could get it up this hill and see if it happen. Well, yeah. yeah you got it up here. It just, uh, yeah, sliding yeah, back down. It just took off. Yeah, it just sort of slides back down. Yeah, this, uh, it's crazy up here. It really is. You guys remember the video of the Subaru? Uh, it's kind of the same situation. Well, it is the same situation. <laughs> is there another? Well, I guess there is another cabin up there. No, they uh, they backing in here good. Do not pump this hill. That's what I'm gonna tell everybody. <laughs> yeah, just don't do it. That's it, huh? It was gone. Yeah, well, luckily, I don't, did it get up against the tree? No, it didn't. It, it stopped just short of the tree, too. Yeah. See, the, the last one, the Subaru, it went down and it the back end landed against that tree and it blew the back window out. Um, kind of crunched up her quarter. and So it, it sounds like you got really lucky. Yeah. I see your marks. Yeah, I had, uh, I had to crawl out of there. <laughs> That, that was a tough crawl. <laughs> Far out, you on the back. All the way? Yeah. I'm not gonna, it has steel wheels. Maybe we'll take a cable with me if I'm going down. So, you wanna pull this rope there? Oh, yeah. This will be my safest. Yeah, At least I, a, yeah. I'm level up there and. Yeah. You just get a like the last time I did this recovery, I did it. I did it from from here, but 
once I put all that pressure on the back of my truck, my front end's already way up in the air. Yeah. So we, it wanted to, it wanted to pop wheelies. Oh no. <laughs> that was kind of scary. How much cable do I have over there? I wonder. Am I getting myself in trouble? Last time we did this, we had old cable. I put new wrap of cable on, and I shorted my. I shorted myself by about 50 foot. Huh? That means that other cable probably won't reach. Because that was the front wheel. Good. I've got I'll I'll come back with this with this rope. Okay. Oh that's back in the corner of that snow. Uh, where's it at? Right there at the uh, on the doors. On the doors. That, that looks like snow. I don't see anything that, here. That white powdery stuff right there. Oh, right here? Oh, that's snow? Yeah, okay. it's all snow building up. Yeah. Okay, I was, I was like, what? <laughs> He's like, when did that happen? <laughs> you know, the side's flying up there. Yeah. <laughs> what length of rope do you want? Oh, it's okay. If you think this will make it, I got two. I should be there. Yep, I'm there. Made it? Yep. Okay. Okay, wheels are shot. I'm going down here and watch. Oh, you're going down? I was gonna let you pull. Oh. I'll do whatever you want. Uh, I mean it's it's fine. Just yeah, just let me know. Yep. Come up as high as I can. Okay, you won't be able to stand there. You'll have to stand yeah, you're gonna come up. up there. Yeah. So this driveway is super steep. So I have my ice cleats on. I'm still going slow because I'm a wimp. I was doing what I wanted to do. Okay, so well, I'll pull. I'll pull if you want me to. down there sliding on the road. Yeah, this car's over here in this ditch. We're pulling them out. Sorry to bother you. Yeah, there's a truck over here. Yeah. yeah. Hold on a second. I'm sorry, what? Never mind.
Yep. Okay. It's almost there. Thank you. You just want to leave that for me just in case? I don't know that much more will come out. Okay. Got a big tree limb with it. There's a big stump under this front tire. If you hold on a second, I'll try to get it. better than none on <laughs> we're most of the way back to the driveway so let's see if we can see it through that lens or not I had it all twisted see if we can get the front over just a little bit more this driveway I hate it this is the third time we've been here for the same spot all three times it was there he was wanting to know if there was any damage I don't know I didn't see but I didn't really walk over there. it made some interesting noises coming out yeah but I I don't know I think it was just all the debris and stuff that's underneath it yeah okay so it's not impossible to tell but uh here, and it was down here. Now, the Subaru was up against that smaller tree right there, and it knocked the back glass out. But it's very hard to, very deceptive on how steep this is. This truck is up there. So, that's level. <laughs> Let me see if it'll pull forward for me because I got one stuck. Okay, there's, uh, I don't know what this debris here is. Right here. Just be careful because there is a lot of ice back there behind you. And he did slide. I think he might have a key. Okay. I don't want to see any damage from this car. It's like I can't walk. You see way down there. It's probably... 15 feet off the road where his tire was. He said he just got this car yesterday. So that's no fun. It's 2019. We can make 
I have to do. I don't see any damage. I think it's very fortunate. I don't see anything. I don't see a scratch. I'm behind you, Jeff, so <laughs> give me a second to get out of the way. I don't know where to go. I didn't see anything. How far back do you need to go, Jeff? Forward. Okay, he's gonna come forward a little bit, so come over here to the side for me. Yeah. Oh. Hold it, emergency brake. Just be careful. Um. That will happen to me. That's nerve wracking. Yeah, it's like, no, I'm not going to go. I just need to get this out of here. And flip it against the... Against the hubcap to break. Um, careful because it might... I might have to get the old jack out there. Okay, well... The emergency brake's on, but... Yeah, I know, but still... Yeah. Oh, goodness. There we go. Oh, goodness. Okay. I guess probably what we'll have to do is go to the bottom. Okay. Listen, I just want you to be super careful because there's ice right there. Okay. Yeah. This. This. Okay. Yeah, that'd be an awesome Please be careful. I know. It's so scary. I'm so glad that you're okay. I'm glad I'm okay too. The last, the, well, the first time we were up here, the people, they slid down and they hit that tree and they lost their back glass. Yeah, I'm, I am so glad. Oh, I know. You know, because that's better than having this thing, then. Uh-huh, yeah. Stay on my side. There's less ice. So I have a question. Did you get your luggage out of the back while you were down there? Uh, yeah, I had some. I had got my bag out. Um, because I think I see a belt down there against that tree. This, this first it tree. Be, uh, I can't see it, I'll run down there and grab it here in just a second. As soon as he gets the rest of the way down here. Okay. Uh, thank you. You're welcome. I'm probably blinding him. He's almost there. Fantastic. Oh, oh, I know. What, what did it get? I guess it got stuck in there. It mud. just got stuck right here. Yeah, you're very fortunate that it didn't go the rest of the way down. Yeah, I know it so, went all the way to that tree down there, and it would be it. Yes, yeah, the, they hit the that tree. Yes. All right, battery died. Forgive me. Uh, but nothing exciting happened after that. Jeff walked down and got his belt and the fella's wallet that fell out and it was up against that tree. Jeff is going to attempt to turn around here because he does not like backing down this driveway. Last time he did it, I, I about died. <laughs> Your wheel's okay for right now. Keep, you're good over here for right now. It's gonna dip down a little bit. We all know Jeff's the king of backing up. He'll be fine. You're good. Beautiful. Keep going if you can. Hold up. Hold up. I'm walking across in front of you. Please don't move. Okay, you have room to back up. Keep coming. You might go more. Go more. Go back more. There's nothing in front of you. Go back more. Yeah, I like that. Can you see in front of you? Yeah, I'm riding. I'm not walking down that again. I'll tell you one thing I'm not doing is putting my seatbelt on. <laughs> It'll lock up and you'll be choked to death. If it's time to bail out, it's time to bail out. Well, I'm just going to go down with the ship because I'm not fast. We've got room over here. Find the way from here. Those are sliding. Definitely sliding. You know, four legs? No, I'm in neutral. 
Metro with the e-brake on. Hmm. down there. That made it. Almost to the promised land. Where'd you put his car? Uh, he moved it up. I had it right there by the trash cans, but he put it over in the... Oh, he put it right there in between those cars. Yeah. Hope it's still there in the morning. Anything else to say about that? That driveway is crazy, man. I despise that driveway. So last time I came out, I, I really hate winching on the super. I mean, that is that is as steep of a driveway as you'll ever want to walk up. So when I put my truck on it, I mean, you've got, you know, oil and everything that just, you know, it's not level, you know. So we even get some cars that um, will shut off because of, you know, oils way back on the on the oil pan and sensors can't pick up so i really despise winching and putting my truck in those situations um so i try to put my truck on level now last time we came out i got kind of in front of it and um was able to get a higher lift and it was just an easier recovery short of keeping my front end down because when my truck's setting up obviously it wants to tilt tip backwards even easier the last two times i did the recovery in that driveway i went all the way up to the flat spot which is kind of tough because I can't really get a bunch of lift. So I'm, I'm pulling the car, I'm pulling the car kind of into the bank a little bit. Um, so I don't, it's, it's a little bit of a tougher pull, but it's still, it's loose dirt, it's snow and things like that. And um, I was still popping some pretty good wheelies at the top of the hill and we had uh, everything locked in and brakes locked and wheel chalked and, but anyway, that driveway will get you. And it's usually not the going up part. It's usually when people were leaving that driveway, they don't feel comfortable with turning around up there at the top and then they try to back down. And once they back down and like he said, you get one wheel off, it's game over, game That's over. Right. But anyway, I'm gonna see if we can make it off this mountain before it gets too much icier. Maybe try to grab some shut eye. It's 12:30. Maybe, maybe not. Catch you on the next one.